Will you tell me something, Mr. Lumberjack? Is it one for forward and three for back? Is it two for stop or four for go? So here we have a beautiful ash, except it's dead. I marked it last summer. And it's got a pretty extreme forward lean. I think that's about 10 degrees or so. <clears throat> so from the Bible, how to fell a tree, how to handle these trees. The first thing we do is cut the open face notch and I've already done that. I should have recorded earlier. But uh, <clears throat> what we do here is come in at 60 or 65 degrees at the top and then 30 or so at the bottom. And I think we're right at about 90. Let's see here. I'd say so. Okay, now the next step is to, according to the book, uh, we're gonna do a bore cut about an inch and a half above the notch. Um, and because this tree is wider than my bar, my bar is 16, this tree looks like about, it's about 18, 20 or so. Um, it's a four step process, actually five step. Will you tell me something, Mr. Lumberjack? Is it one for forward and three for back? We're gonna go in here and back, and then because it's wider than my bar, the tree is, on the other side, same thing except we're gonna do start here and work our way towards the notch and leave a strap here at the back and that's the last thing so we can get out of the way while it falls so let's uh, do this bore cut on this side and I'll be back in a minute we've done the bore cut on this side of the tree and you can kind of see there's some light coming through on the other side so the tree is just barely past 16 inches the length of my bar but we're gonna have to go on the other side and do what I said before uh, to do the other other bore cut so it turns out just popping through on the other side of the tree is pretty handy because that'll that's a mark for us to, uh, to start our bore cut here uh, and then work our way back towards the notch all right so we've <clears throat> made the bore cut on the other side I don't think Jeff Jepson would be too happy with my angle here it should be more uh, horizontal, but at any rate, we're ready to roll here on the uh, on the back cut. As you can see, there's there we go. There's daylight through this tree. Uh, we're just gonna cut that the the strap. That's step five, and it should fall safely. Let's see. One thing I forgot to mention here is um, obviously we're gonna be cutting. Uh, the strap this way um, and we've I've made a little escape path here so uh, although we should be safe no chance of barber cheering here I don't think um, I sure hope not okay so there's our tree on the ground that is gonna be fun to split and uh, make a lot of great fires and here's our stump uh, as you can see, I, I cut in from here and uh, those last little fibers hung on until it tipped over. Um, there's our notch, not crazy about that angle uh, on the bore cut, but whatever, uh, it, it, it worked. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Well, you work in the woods from morning to night. You laugh and sing and you cuss and fight. On Saturday night, you go to Eugene.